The Albion renew their fierce rivalry with Crystal Palace and, as ever, there's so much at stake. Patrick Vieira's side are yet to win a game in 2023 and are at risk of being sucked into a relegation battle, whilst Roberto De Zerbi has masterminded an unbeaten start to the new year, which has fans dreaming of Europe. Current form suggests a win for the Seagulls, but going on past experience of games between these two sides, absolutely anything can happen. Players take the knee ahead of kickoff. March dancing through the Palace defence. McAllister just overran it and allows the visitors to clear. And McAllister's been penalised for a foul. And caught the Cure. And apologise for it as well. Oh, he's just caught him high up on the shin there. Look like there will be a VAR intervention for that one. I feel to Dekure. McAllister already on a yellow is hustling him, but he's done well and he sets March on his way. Gross is getting forward. March, great ball to McAllister, who's in, and Quaita gets it away. And at the second time of asking, McAllister disappointed in himself. He initially set the move on its way by winning it back. March had runners to his right through the centre, to his left. There was McAllister, just didn't catch the shot with any real force. Another look, he uh, has his eyes firmly on the ball, but Guaita was down quickly. It's a judge to have been fouled. Gross, that's nicely done, very nicely done. It drops to McAllister, Guaita beats it away. Intricate, inventive passing from Brighton to open up Crystal Palace. This was the key pass, Gross. Then the touch from Undav, it rolled to McAllister, looking to bend it beyond Guaita. To Estepinian. Smartly done, Dunk. Now Mitoma, he's got Klein a little isolated here. That's nicely done, Mitoma could be a Mitoma, Guaita again. To the rescue for the hosts. The chances are starting to flow now for Brighton. This is a lovely give and go. Matoma into March and was heading for that far corner. Guaita read it, sprang to his left to flick it away. Good stop. Over again, Mr. Pinian. Oh, the ball drops for Gross. Gross could be in. Esther Pinian is there. Esther Pinian with the opener. What a time to score your first goal for the club. The Brighton fans go ballistic. They lead at Selhurst Park. Nothing Guaita could do about that one. He's been busy. But Esther Pinian found the gap. The pass from Gross slightly behind Esther Pinian, but he improvised and scooped it into the corner. And that tells you everything, checking for a possible offside. And now it's Crystal Palace's fans who celebrate the decision and Estepinian hangs his head. Estepinian's lost it. Michael Elisa Mateta, oh, what a block from Webster. That is a fabulous tackle. Pinian losing it. Elisa plays in Mateta. And look at this challenge. That is wonderful. Critical from Webster. March again. March lining one up, kicking his way in field. Beautifully done from Solly March. Still going here. The long way round, but almost the right way through. It'll be a corner, mesmeric from March. Once, twice, three times, he looks if he was going to hit it. He didn't fancy the shot, took on the lot. And his cross almost converted into a goal by McAllister. Ball here, 
McAllister. Good challenge on him by Elisa. Mitoma wins it back. Estepinian in support. No one can control it for a second. Estepinian comes away with it. Estepinian fires it across and it's in. Solly March at the back post to give Alpian the lead. Silencing Selhurst Park. Solly March. Well, a muted reaction from Roberto De Zerbi. He knows there's plenty of time left in the game, but that is richly deserved for the Albion. And Solly March continues his scoring form. Brilliant from Estepinian. Just looked up. Look at that for a cross. Tyrick Mitchell caught napping. Great ball, pace and bend on it, and Solly March just wanted it more at the back post and had the composure to guide it into the roof of the net. Webster had all the time in the world to find Veltman. Field he goes to Ferguson, who's not fouled by Gerhi. Mateta is fouled by Webster. Fair to say, Adam Webster disagrees. But it looks like Michael Oliver was correct in his assessment. That was a foul. Elisa arcs it in. Oh, Sanchez has dropped it and Tompkins is there. And out of absolutely nothing, Crystal Palace are level. Oh, he's every right to be frustrated, Robert Sanchez. He came for it confidently and then spilt it. And Tompkins had time and space and the easiest job in the world to nod it into the empty net. And it's Crystal Palace 1, Brighton 1. So disappointing from an Albion perspective. Patrick Vieira with absolutely zero reaction from the Palace and Brighton players. We're into the final 10 minutes, which is officially Albion territory. They've made a wonderful habit of scoring late. They're looking to do so again here. As De Cure hacks down Estepinian and is shown the yellow card for his troubles. He's definitely caught him there. First things first, Brighton have a free kick. Gross. It goes and it drifts beyond the far post. A little touch from McAllister, gross across. And I think there was, there was a Palace touch, another Albion corner, another chance for Gross to deliver. Gross, great header and past the post. McAllister, I thought he'd scored. In the whole of Sellers Park, thought he'd scored. Great delivery from Gross. Unmarked, McAllister just needed to guide it into the corner. He's just got too much on it. And it slipped past the post. The throw. Gross as well to keep it in. And the nutmeg from March. Brilliant. He's got to the byline. March still has it. March across. Oh, it's not gone in. Palace has scrambled it clear. Will frustrate Patrick Vieira. Estepinian. Another crossing opportunity. McAllister, Guaita, right behind it. Just not happening for Alexis McAllister in front of goal this afternoon. He's been in the right places, but just hasn't quite found the right finish. More wonderful work from Estepinian. Guaita, solid again. And there is the final whistle. The spoils are shared between these two at Selhurst Park once again. Brighton, the better side throughout, finally took the lead through Solly March at the back post from Estepinian's cross. But an error from Sanchez led to James Tompkins' level up. It ends here at Selhurst Park, Crystal Palace 1, Albion 1.